welcome back Troglodytes to another episode of Trogly's Guitars. Today's kind of an unusual video, but I had wanted to mount my camera to a guitar, so I had taken apart the Snark tuner, and I thought, you know, I wonder how many other people are curious about what is inside a Snark tuner. So today's video is tearing apart a Snark tuner. Now if you don't know what this is, this is a clip-on tuner that helps you tune many different instruments. They're very popular for guitars. So without any further ado, let's go ahead and take this apart. You can see that this one's already been taken apart, but what you're first going to want to do here is get your nail in this area and start to separate the tuner from the body. Now once you get it this far, don't be a dumbo. Stop and remove the battery and then you'll find a little screw right here and you need to get a very tiny little screwdriver and take that apart to avoid damaging your unit. So once you got that undone, this will come off just fine and here you have the inside of the Snark tuner. So here's what the inside of your Snark tuner looks like and that is the back side of the screen that you're viewing. Here's what the screen will look like here. You can see it's attached to the circuit board right there. And here's your up and down tempo buttons. And this is your pitch button right there. I'm guessing this just kind of helps secure it in place. And that's where your battery goes. And I'm guessing this is what makes the sound maybe for the metronome. So overall, I mean, it's fairly cool to see the inside of it. You can see the model number there. This is, is what the interior of the body was. What I was trying to do was get an inexpensive clip for my iPhone once again so I could get different camera angles while playing. To, to kind of further the show, just to make it look better, this is what I was trying to do. I had taped this to the back of my phone cover, and in the end it didn't work because this wasn't quite strong enough. But I thought this was just something interesting to share. And to put it back together, you just put your little yellow button back in. Then you put the ring back on over it. Then you'll want to make sure you get your buttons lined back up in the base of the body. So now that those are back in, you just line up the tempo button back with its spot. And you click it back together and then make sure you tighten your screw back down. Then you insert your battery again. And if you did all that right, it should turn right back on. So I hope you try lights enjoyed this inside look of a snark tuner. I don't know how many more videos like this I'll do, but hey, I've got quite a few really interesting guitars that I've never reviewed before. We're talking some nice Guitar of the Week series, some really, really rare Les Pauls are coming on the way. Some of those I've already done videos on, but it's always cool to see new examples. But lots of weird and interesting stuff coming. So stay tuned to the channel. Uh, after today, it should be pretty steady. I would say a week, week and a half of just really nice reviews and demos. All right, Charlie Lights, thanks for watching. And we will catch you tomorrow on the next episode. Take care.